Hi everybody, I am back with another finished project. Um, here is another uh, custom order. And I just wanted to come and share this with you all before I get it off into the mail for her. Um, I'm gonna try and just do a real quick flip through on this one. I'm not gonna um, get into any detail just because I got cut off on my last one. So this is take two. But um, for some reason I can't quit yammering on. <laughs> But anyhow, I just wanted to let you know the kit that I did use for this is by Dreams Etc. It's called Antique Collage. Super, super beautiful kit. I also used um, some paper from the Prima Stack Cigar Box Secrets. And I just used the little 6x6 pad. And this is it here. This is the collection here. So really, really pretty. Coordinated really well with this collection as well. So um, I just wanted to let you know that's what I used in here. I've got lots of printables in here from uh, many different sites. So um, I'll try my best to link the sites that I used below as well, um, in case you all are interested. But uh, let's just go ahead and, and go over the journal really quickly. Um, everything in here is coffee stained. Uh, it's just a single signature. I used some um, hand-dyed seam binding for the closure. And uh, what else? What else? That's it. Let's just go ahead and go on in. I hope everybody's doing well. I've been so busy, you guys. I wish I could come and um, get into my craft room a lot more often than I have been. But unfortunately, time has just not allowed that for me. So... Um, I do what I can, <laughs> but anyhow, um, so this one obviously is really meaty because I can't seem to do them any other way, but, um, let's just go ahead and do a quick flip through. Again, all the paper in here is coffee stained. I did do some stamping in this one that just says always dream. I'll try to make it really quick, everybody. There's a pocket there with some tags. This one says it's better to take a risk than miss a moment of magic. And this one says every now and then life needs to be turned upside down to get back to the right way up. Um, she wanted birds and flowers for the theme in here. So I did try to um, incorporate lots of bird images and floral uh, backgrounds for her. There's just a little sheet of paper that says every day is a new beginning. Just blank on the back. I've got a combination of both um, just uh, coffee dyed paper and then I've got also um, my craft paper as well. There's another tag. Enjoy the little things in life for one day you'll look back and realize they were the big things. And then here's another image or car uh, journaling sheet there. That one I just stamped enjoy every moment on the back. Isn't that pretty? I love the colors in this collection. So pretty. And the images, the graphics, everything is just beautiful. Here's an envelope. It's just empty so she can put whatever she wants in there. Plenty of journaling space in here and lots of um, removable elements as well. So she can eliminate a ton of the bulk if she decides to take that stuff out of here. <clears throat> this tag says being happy doesn't mean everything's perfect. It means you decide to see beyond the imper imperfections. <laughs> oh, Lord. And this one says, don't tell God how big your problems are. Tell your problems how big God is. She also wanted inspirational quotes in here as well. There's a little file folder, and it's just blank inside. And I just stamped that with remember. There's the ribbon that I thread through the side of the page. There's another journaling sheet and that one says you were given this life because you were strong enough to live it. I love, love that stamp. And 
Here's an altered paper clip. Aren't those images beautiful? It's another journaling card there. That one says, faith consists in believing what is, what is, oh God, here I go. Faith consists in believing when it is beyond the power of reason to believe. <laughs> Too much coffee today, people. <laughs> There's a couple more tags. And that one says laugh more. And this one I stamped what a day. What a day indeed. <laughs> Here's another little file folder here. And I just stamped little moments on that one. And that's blank inside as well. Everything um, has been inked up with vintage photo and walnut stain. <clears throat> There's another journaling card and I stamped faith is the strength by which a shattered world shall emerge into the light. Helen Keller. <clears throat> My throat has been so dry. I don't know if it's allergies or what the deal is, but. Here I've just got a sheet of journaling paper that I've just bound with some seam binding. And it's um, just tucked into this little pocket that I created out of a glass seam bag, a few banners, a prima flower, and then this little postcard image here. And then there's another tag. And I stamped noteworthy on the back of that. Isn't that image on that postcard printable so pretty? I love that. There's a large pocket in the center of the uh, signature. And it just holds one of these jumbo tags from my shop. And I just um, die cut friends on that one. And I just layered a doily, a couple of banners, and a um, little bird image there. <clears throat> There's another side pocket and that journaling card just says hope. This is just um, some coffee stained card. And then we've got some more um, tags behind this little, I used this image to create a pocket. So there's that tag there. And it's just blank on the back. And then there's this one. That one says something sweet. And then we've got that one there. And that one says, aren't you lovely? So those all just fit right behind here. another card here and I just topped it off with some uh, hemp cord a button and stamped it with the word piece down at the bottom and I did do some of the corner punching there <clears throat> it's another little bird image that I layered on several sheets of uh, pattern paper and just put some little prima flowers and some fibers There's a belly band that says miracles happen. And then that's just some stationery that I coffee dyed. I'm sorry everybody if I'm just ripping through this. I just don't want to get cut off again. <laughs> Just did some stamping on the sides there. Aren't these images so pretty? I love her kits. Love, love, love her kits. Here's a tag that says, I am perfect just the way I am. And the tags um, are all uh, 65 pound card. And then here's one of the trifold time cards from my shop. She can use that to do some journaling as well. These are a lot of fun. 
anything that I've used in the journal that I carry in my shop, I'll leave. make sure to leave the links for you all in the description box below if you're interested as well. Here's another little tag here with that bird image. And that one just says details on the back. Here's another um, altered paper clip. There's this little journaling card here, and that just says make things happen. I don't know if you can see the little swan image and the cherub, little cherub angel down at the bottom. These um, papers are so pretty from that Prima stack. I love that collection. That tag says believe. I just stapled some um, crochet lace up at the top. There's another little um, tag there, or little journaling card. That tag there says, what you believe in becomes true. Believe in something absurd. And then here's another um, journaling sheet here. And that just says, God's answers are wiser than our prayers. Here I just created a pocket out of some lace. And it's just got another journaling sheet there. And then this little pocket, I just adhered this glassine bag on top of the lace there. Topped it off with this um, image here and then there's just a tag from the kit inside there and that just says lovely day. I still need to punch a hole through there and put some ribbon on that one. I forgot that one. That one slipped by me. <laughs> Doesn't that lace match up so pretty with this page? I think the color is like spot on. Love it, love it. It just says happy. Here's another envelope. It's just empty. And here's the back cover. And I've just got um, a little jelly bean sack there, a couple of hearts, clock face, a few silk flowers, a butterfly from uh, the Martha Stewart punch. And then I've just got the word imagination there. And then there's a tag in there. And aren't those images pretty? That's This is another sheet from the Cigar Box Secrets. And I just stamped so much fun on the back of that one. And then inside the back pocket. Oh, and then you can also tuck something right behind here if you want as well. And then I've got, again, another um, piece of stationery in the back pocket here. Let's see those birds up there on the corner. And then there's another jumbo tag, and this one says dream. All right, and it's just blank on the back as well. So that's it, everyone. That is my um, newest completed project. So anyhow, I have got a couple more that I'm still working on. So um, as those are completed, I will come on and upload those. Um, I've had a ton of people messaging me on custom orders and I'm, I'm trying to get back to you guys as soon as I can. Um, I know that, you know, some of you have, I have answered and there's some that I, you know, I've, I've not been able to get to all the messages. They're kind of, kind of flooding in and I'm, I think I'm feeling a little overwhelmed. <laughs> But I'll definitely get back to you. So please, please be patient with me. Don't, I don't want you to feel like I've um, not seen your messages or I'm just not responding because that is definitely not the case. I am just trying to figure out um, my schedule and trying to see where I can work in um, all the orders. So uh, I just, I just did want to let you all know that I, you know, I've, I've got all your messages there and I am responding to them. Um, but I just am asking for your patience and I appreciate so much all of the support and um, you guys are just awesome. My, my viewers are so incredible and I appreciate each and every one of you. So um, 
Until next time, everybody, you guys all have a wonderful evening and we'll be talking with you all again soon, okay? Thank you so much. Have a good night. Bye.